Ryan, can you feel that? Change is in the air. It is, Pamela. Hey, tenors, we're trying something new at the 10 News. We're dropping headlines on Tuesday and in-depth reports on Wednesdays. That means it's time for the 10 things you need to know right now. Processing. First up, after months of speculation, promises, backtracking, and a lawsuit, Elon Musk bought Twitter for $44 billion. The richest man on earth changed his Twitter bio to head twit and fired the CEO, CFO, and the head of trust and safety on his first day of being in charge. That sounds sticky. And you know what else is sticky? Snot. The rare I.I. is a primate with a super long finger that it sometimes uses to pick its nose and eat its boogers. Gross! Many primates do this, and some scientists think there could be health benefits. But the risk of spreading bacteria and viruses is also high. So think twice before you go digging for gold. And a reminder to be weary about what you see on social media. A video from 2021 that was edited to make Vice President Kamala Harris say something false is making the rounds again. (sighs) Fact checkers say the video, which shows the VP saying most people in the hospital with COVID are vaccinated, was edited and she actually said the exact opposite. COVID-19 vaccines are proven to be safe and effective. Yep. And in the Philippines, a college professor challenged her engineering students to make anti-cheating hats to wear during exams. Students accepted the challenge in hilarious and clever ways. You can check out photos of the anti-cheating headwear at the link in our show notes. Nice. Neanderthals are ancient relatives of modern humans, and they went extinct thousands of years ago. But scientists have found the remains of the first known family of Neanderthals in a cave in Russia. This find is helping scientists understand how Neanderthals lived, in what ways they're similar and different from modern humans. Uh Rapper Yee, formerly known as Kanye West, expressed anti-Semitic views, which means hate speech against Jewish people, in the past few weeks. In response, his social media accounts were restricted and several brands have dropped him as a collaborator, including Adidas, the makers of his shoe brand Yeezys. Taylor Swift's new album, Midnight, dropped, but fans and activists expressed concern that one of her music videos contained an anti-fat scene. Swift edited the video in response. Good job! Every year, hundreds of competitors try to clean up the Everglades of invasive snakes. This year, the 19-year-old winner of the Florida Python Challenge was Matthew Conception, who caught 28 invasive Burmese pythons. In total, 248 snakes were removed during the 10-day competition. Here, kitty, kitty, here, kitty, kitty. Did you ever wonder if your cat actually likes when you use your cat voice? Well, scientists say they do. Talking to your cat like they're a baby can actually make your bond stronger. So don't be embarrassed to say, Who's the best little kitty you are? It's you, Mr. Fluffykins. And if you're more of a dog person like me, why not give your pup an extra special treat? A new restaurant has opened in San Francisco that's just for dogs. Former chef Rami Masarwe opened Dog to give doggos a fine dining experience, to which we say bon appetit. <laughs> that was 10 things you need to know right now. Check out tomorrow's episode where we'll dive into world news and the World Series. I'm Pamela Kirkland. And I'm Ryan Willard. Thanks for listening to the 10 News. Data transfer complete. The Camp Monsters podcast by REI Co-op Studios is back for a fourth season. From monsters hiding among the trees to creatures haunting the lakeshore, these are the stories of impossible encounters with impossible creatures in the wildest corners of North America. Join us as we travel the country, sit around campfires, and talk about that thing that ran across the trail in the middle of the night, just beyond the beam of your flashlight. You'll be safe if only you can make it to the campfire. Tune into Camp Monsters wherever you listen to podcasts.